Hey everybody and welcome back to Nightbringers Watch. I am your host Falk and tonight we finally can continue our way through uh Um Kogomon. Ha! We are playing Kogomon. Right, uh I already entered this funny cave. And uh, I grinded a bit and uh I tried something out and I used that rod that you can use when you're on that boat that we got uh, last time from wait who, who's that guy called a uh, house and uh, this this guy in the wheelchair uh that's the one that gave us that that board um and i uh, might have a surprise uh not that it might interest you, but ah, uh, you'll see, you'll see. I found something uh, pretty awesome. Ah, oh, a gem detected, but I don't want to go for a gem. I am going for that skill flash. Also, let's fight that guy there. Regina, it's all about competition. How about a head-to-head -head Coromon battle? I'm all for that. I think the music's a bit... bit, uh... low? I'm going to... uh, raise it after that fight. Yeah, Megalobite is now uh, level 61, which is quite high, I think. And um, you saw the fight against that last titan, right? No problem at all. Um, I played um, Neptunia X and Rankagura and I was going for every achievement. I made it. Uh, but through that I got pretty used to grinding. So grinding in Koromon is fun. Uh, compared to what I had to do there. Uh, ended up in second place, not again. Alright. Good, I was not the database. I was about to go for the settings. Kogamon has nice music and we should enjoy it. Um... Why does that look like a collapsed doorway? Can we push? I want to add them. No, it doesn't look like we can open that. All right. Um. Oh, it's still glowing. And now, first Wild Kormon battle. Alright, Megalobite. Crunch. We are 30 level above. That's quite the number. Oh, Froshell awakened some potential. Uh, we are going for some defense here. Did that do damage? Also fully rested, but I don't think that it will stand the crunch. Good. And the master achieved. I think that's the one for ten fights. I want to switch again to wait to the scan. And uh, we need to go through this cavern because we need to reach a volcano, I think it was. And uh, to reach the volcano... Yeah, we have to go through the tunnel. Oh, damn it. Um, 
on that volcano. There, there I was going for. On that volcano might be the next titan. Hey Dork, did you just splash water in my face on purpose? Because I've got to teach you a lesson. Yeah. Fidio! I think I'm going to give uh, that pity boat that sleuth gem so we can level it. Don't think that we need to level Frosha a little bit more. Alright, and Megalobite reached level 30, uh, 62, 32 for Froshal. Sending out what? Ah, oh, Aruara. Oh, head crash. The heavy attack is pretty awesome against that thing. Isn't that the second form of that uh, frost bear thingy? That we could have chosen in in, uh, in the beginning. And to be honest, I want to catch them, but I don't think that we are going to find them uh, in the near future. Why did we miss so much? Oh, damn it, we need to regenerate. Ah, shit. There you go. Shared Tooth reached level 50. Ah. Let's try it with a Bitty Bolt for now. We are faster. Whoa. Though we did not do much. Wait, what? That splash should have easily killed me. All right. <laughs> Is that a balloon? <laughs> Good. Uh, quad vault. Steer tooth got stuck. And you know what? We are going to regenerate or to re even revive our Megalobite. And for that we need a Phoenix Stone. If you want to notice uh, uh, the... the Surprise that I have. You might have already seen it in the Coromon uh, in, in the Coromon selection. Yeah, okay, I guess I need some lessons too. 3k gold. Ah, nice. Alright, um, that's the surprise that, that I have. I found my first perfect Koromon. Um, it's been a Doom pod that I already evolved into Sandril. And I wanted to give that item to Billy Boat. Because Billy Boat might come in handy in this uh, cavern. Since there are so many water tied Pokemon. Alright, found the chest. Rubber fruit. I f find it somewhat interesting that there are so many lights falling onto onto this those plants. Let's try it with Guildwing. Feather Fury. Uh, we're doing not as much damage as that thing. How about a Wind Blast? 
That did some damage. Oh, this this attack is brutal. Guess the big guy has to to do it. I don't know. I have to guild wing a lot uh, for now. For a really long time. But I never trained it. I don't know why. Could be a cool Koromon though. And I think it also still has an evolution stage. Oh, Bitty Bold awakens the potential. Then let's go with attack. With a one or two. Uh, Physical attacks that it can learn. Oh, nothing here. Oh, shit, I'm almost fishing. Oh, hey, there's another, another dude. Whoa! Petition! Ha! There you are! Oh, those, those blue guys. Roller. The essence locator we procured off your colleague is quite accurate indeed. The plan is coming together. With all of these tools in our command, Ran will rise once more. Wait, who? What? Who? Just what are you planning? Oh, will be quite grand. You'll see. Everyone will see. Soon. Ha <laughs> ha. Uh we found the essences that uh means the device is accurate. We should command the digging back in the temple. Yes, but first Roller, let's show this human a glimpse of the future. Release the subjects now. Oh, this little guy is reminded me of home. But for now, they serve as a welcome distraction. Dangerous Santilla appears. I think these are some things that we can't catch, right? And every attack that we have is not effective against those. We're still dealing tons of damage. Special defense increased. Oh, that's nice. That should help against a quicksand. <laughs> Though it does hardly damage at all. Oh, hazy. No. That is not good. Okay, let's get rid of the first scintilla. Bidibo crew to level 19. An earthquake of magnitude 5. How much damage was that? 5? You know what? We are going to regenerate some SP. Let's try that uh, head crash. Super drain. Okay. Oh, that did hardly some damage. I 
should go and or stick with a uh, upper blaster. There you go. A critical hit, that's nice. Perhaps ending that fight. Ah, just a bit faster. What what are they doing to these Karamon? Okay, so we fought them and no, they're gone. Gee, these motorized surfboards are perfect for catching some sweet waves. But I don't see any around. Hey, I got it. Let's make our own waves. Ah. Matma. It's that ghost thing. Let's try it with Sandril. Oh, I uh, should. Um. Oh, wait, that's like nothing. A twenty percent chance to knock down. I should uh, check the attacks of that Sandril. That takes too long. Um, the scary vision has some scary tunes. Let's blow away that mud. All right. Video crew to level 20. Old bomb unlocked. Powerful attack which depletes up to 60 points of the user's remaining SP. The power is three times the SP depleted. Sounds fun. Alright, we disable cute post and activate bolt bomb for now. Wait, who cut claw? Ooh, that looks cool. I think that's uh, Philly's next stage. Use Epiphany increases attack and defense. Yeah, doesn't help though. Stand. Mm -hmm. A wound opened. Then let's regenerate some SP for the next couple moment to come. Wow. We are going to increase um, megalobytes attack. Here we are going for a special attack. That's a doom pot. All right. All right. We've been knocked down. So yeah, need to regenerate or recover from that fall. And that's the fight. Not that scary. Man, I don't get why my butts dragged me to this boring cave. I crave some real waves. 
might want to go outside. All right. We are using two of our cakes and we might want to... Ah, you know what? Buildwing can rest. Ether sand. Uh, there you go. Push that away. Uh, tricked you. Found the combi cake, but I don't see where we can continue. Oh, there's an item. A potent scent. Let's fight that trainer. Yeah, alright. Look, here's how it is. The human body needs to rest at regular intervals. I am not tired at all. Besides, my Coromon perform much better on land. Okay. Repaired. Are you though? I don't think that you've been prepared. Did hit our megalobite. Let's jump again. Sigma. Very effective. Digmo has fainted and I think that's been all. Oh god, the we are grinding uh, Megalobytes levels so hard. Just a uh, thought, please don't tell my friends, they never stop calling me Jedaquat. Okay. Can you tell me where I can continue my adventure? Good sir. Maybe being called Jellacroft isn't so bad. According to Lux Solis, it's one of the strongest Coromon around. Okay. Doesn't help me though. Ah, come on. Ah. What did I not see? Where can I continue? Ah. No. Nothing out there. Oh, wait, here. Damn, I'm blind. Blind to these things. Oh, hey. Treasure awaits. But that guy looks like rat. Tito, I know why you're here. Do you know the ancient saying? The coconut is always sweeter on a tree that you can't reach. Which coconut? 
All right, that's a normal Coromon, so poison is very effective. We are going for some jumping. And what's the next? A swimmy. A swimmy on level 42. That's devotion, I tell you. That is a devotion to swimmy. We devote crew to level 26. Revenge Jaws. Uh, if target makes contact with the user this round, deal double the damage taken back at them. Huh. So it's a foul attack. Then let's forget jump and reactivate bolt bomb. He who rubs his enemy's face in the sand gets buried in the sand with him. Okay. I'll take the treasure then. Some large cakes. Mmm, I love me some cakes. Ah, uh, here. I want to have those treasures. A Luna sect. Also a normal thing. Oh, it got poisoned. Nice. Ah. But Megalobite got shocked. <sighs> Annoying. Wait, where? Ah, up there at the chest. All right. Wait, crunch? Ah, yeah, crunch. Wait, what's that? How? Let's let's go with Pity Boat. I am going to use Quad World. Oh, nice. To go crew to level 27 precision punch. Ah, wow, pretty hit chance increased. Nah, shit. Alright, we are waiting some more potential, we are putting that into special attack. 